Hey guys, and welcome to the video, and I hope that you are feeling awesome. All right, guys, I am looking forward to today. I have decided I'm going to go out and do some deer hunting, and I mean that in the most kindest possible way. For many, many months, I have seen so many pictures of deer on Facebook, but I've never really got my own picture yet. So I thought, do you know what? I'm going to go out there and get some pictures and maybe some videos of some deers today. I've got to say, I'm not 100% happy that it's started to rain. However, I am blessed that I have got a waterproof case for my phone and also I've packed myself an umbrella as well. <laughs> Alrighty guys, now we're in the car and that horn has stopped going off, thank God for that. I am hopefully looking forward to getting some good amount of um, pictures and videos of some deer today. But anyways, let's get on the road, eh? Wow guys, this area is really really good and it's very secluded to be honest. Now when I got off the main road, um, I was like, where is this taking me? And then we just got to this location here and this is really really nice. Wow guys, the first thing I've come across is two benches and the view from here is absolutely beautiful. Now guys, I gotta be honest, this is a perfect location for a time travel video. Gotta be honest, I am so glad it stopped raining as well. One thing I've got to take in consideration, guys, is I've not been to this location before and I really don't know where I'm going, so I'm looking to keep my eye out on the things. I like landmarks type thing, so I know how to get back to the car. Look what we've got, guys. There's a squirrel. <laughs> oh, that was so cool. We've got bricks here, guys. This is the corner here, and the wall goes all the way where my finger is pointing, all the way over to there. So I will be coming back here and do an adventure video here and find out exactly what that is all about. What is this? Frida mascot, New Zealand rifles, 1918, friends of Canic Chase. Wow. I don't know what to say, really, to be honest. I didn't expect to see something like that. Mind you, I didn't expect to see that wall down there. So there's a lot of this area that is quite like, hmm, what's going on here? We got some duckies. Now the thing is definitely making me uh, question is why is there ducks in this area where there's no water? Or is there water and I can't see it? Wow guys, now that's a huge hill. But just look at the view from here. Don't get me wrong guys, I like Chetway's Coppice, you know, and you know all the lovely greenery around where I live. But when you go out and you see other greenery areas, you're like, oh my god, that is beautiful. Well anyways, I'm gonna now make my way back to the car because I do want to get myself some food because I have now worked up a bit of an appetite. But I will say one thing, guys. I have really, really enjoyed my time out today. And I wish I had a little bit longer because there were so many areas that I would like to have had a look down. Okay, guys, I'm back at the car now and I'm about to have some food. However, I looked out the window and I thought, oh my God, can I get a time lapse from this location? Just look at that view there, guys. Now I'm hoping I'm gonna be able to create a little bit of a time lapse whilst I'm having my food. see that movement guys I'm trying to be as steady as I possibly can but we have a deer right behind those branches you just see some movement there on the there you go can you see that I hope you've seen that I was literally just finishing off my food guys and I literally looked to my right hand side I thought what's that over there and I thought 
It's a freaking deer. I want to see how close I get to that deer. Did you see it or not? Guys, I think I'm gonna have to come back here another day and spend a bit of time maybe in the bushes and try and get a bit stealth mood. That was absolutely brilliant that I got to see it with my eyes, but I really hope it's come up on camera. Well, anyways, it's that time now to go and hit the road and get back to Rugeley. Alrighty guys, we are here and that did not take me that long to drive to be honest. It only took about 16 to 17 minutes. Now I'm gonna literally speed walk it to the store because I am literally desperate for the loo because I've been out for about two hours and uh, idiot me forgot to go to the loo before leaving. That feels a lot better guys. <laughs> now time to go find Rich Chill, Yvonne's at. I see you. Hello there. Hello. Hello. You having a good shift? Oh, yeah. Awesome. Well guys, I'm gonna let her carry on serving her wonderful customers she's got. And then we and Yvonne are going to be going into town apparently. We are not going to town, I've been told. We're doing that on Friday. So today we're gonna literally get in the car and go home. And uh, I don't know, don't know what we're doing tonight to be honest. Wow guys, the sky this morning, absolutely beautiful. Wow, look at that sky there, guys. It's not showing up on camera enough, but that is really, really pink. However, I gotta say that yesterday when I went out, I had so much fun. And that area of Brockton, you're definitely gonna get adventured, that's for sure. I'm gonna have to get my skates on, guys, because I'm getting myself ready for work. All right, I've decided to leave the house a little bit earlier than I usually do, because I want to get to a place called the Pear Tree Estate. Now, the reason why I wanna get there, guys, Views from there is absolutely amazing. Look how bright that sun's gonna be today. Well guys, I'm just gonna spend a bit of time here taking some photos or maybe a video for the page, and then I'm gonna have to head on to work. I will say one thing, this weather is turned into horrible. Just look at that sky, guys. Well guys, the sun is slightly peering through the clouds there. Ha! <laughs> How cool is that? Well anyways, I'm now home and I gotta confess, the amount of freaking traffic on the road today was absolutely crazy. And I gotta say one thing, what really frustrates me so much is people not using their indicators. Now I really did wish that I had my camera rolling, honestly guys. Because the amount of times I nearly had to do an emergency stop, I wasn't too sure where the other car was going. But anyway, that's my rant over. I'm going to go and catch up with Yvonne now and um, spend a bit of time with her and uh, see what goes on. What are you up to? Cat litter. Ew. Cat litter. Oh, hello there. Hello. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, guys. All right, anyway, time to crack on and get some stuff done, eh? Fly, buddy, fly. Well, me and Yvonne were literally on our way in, and I literally said to her, look, look, look. And she was like, what, what, I can't see, what, what? I said, it was a rabbit. But literally, it was just here. Just literally ran into here. Oh, bummer. However, guys, look at that beautiful sun there. And look at the clouds. I absolutely love the clouds today, honestly, I do. Alrighty, guys, well, me and Yvonne are at work now, and we're about to head on in. However, guys, um, this time we do have stuff to do in town. I'm hoping to see if I can see another duck on the uh, Rise of Brook again. That'd be good, wouldn't it? What do you reckon? Do you think? I think really good. You think really good? Yes. You think that about everything? I know. <laughs> well, anyway, guys, we're gonna head on in now. Ah, skills. <laughs> <laughs> well guys, I am absolutely happy now, it's uh, home time, I've got to meet up with Yvonne in town 
and then uh, after we've done that, we're going to be uh, getting home and catching up with some stuff around the house. Hello, da. It's not cold. It's not cold. Honestly, guys, it's not cold. This one's a bit of a wimp. Well, a lady just went past with a little girl and she goes, I didn't realise how cold it was. Not me. Obviously. I must be strange because yeah. I'm literally running hot right now and I'm not cold at all. Hi. Uh, hi, how are you? Okay. Uh, I'm fine. Um, you, you, you called? Okay, I don't know. What, what is it you, you, you're calling us for? Do you have any car accident you told me associate? No, I haven't had a car accident. Car accident? No. no. Oh, Devon just got his phone call and I was like, i got to record this. We both have been getting phone calls from these companies saying, you know, you know, we hear you've been in an accident, you, you know, and I'm like, no, we haven't. I thought, have you had an accident? No. Oh, we got amnesia. I don't remember. Well, anyways, I've got so much stuff to catch up with, but I'm glad that, yeah, we had that phone call for you guys, so, uh, here. Wow, guys, the last couple of days, it's just been so fast with stuff going on that I haven't really had the chance to get the camera out, but I've just dropped off Yvonne at work, and being it's a Sunday today, I usually work, but today I'm not at work, so I'm uh, going to be using today in an absolutely fantastic way. Right, well, I have got a few jobs I need to do when I get home, however, I am now off to get a special present for myself. Let's just say I can't wait to pick it up now and uh, definitely can't wait to uh, play with it but I will say one thing I'm not going to show you guys what it is because you guys are going to have to wait till next week's vlog to see it hello there Argos <laughs> guys I'm feeling very very positive and uh, I'm hoping today I'm going to get quite a lot of the uh, jobs that I want to do at home done um, I gotta confess yesterday we had an absolutely belting of a sunset and it was so beautiful lucky enough i set up a time lapse video of it and oh my god it was absolutely beautiful so if you haven't already checked that out click the link in the description below and have a watch that video honestly guys i am literally in my element so to speak i love it when i get a chance to have a day off and she smash out and tidy things up now i gotta be honest now i came across something that i haven't seen for a while many many months ago i asked one of my colleagues to make me some you know glass work and she uh, came up with this for me and I absolutely love it, and I gotta admit, it's so unique. Wow, well, guys, I gotta admit, I am absolutely pleased as punch with the progress I've made today. And I gotta be honest, it is so surprising how much stuff you uh, collect and you don't realize. I have got a little bit for charity, which I'm quite surprised of, considering I went through my stuff, you know, not that long ago. But anyways, I'm gonna chill here for a bit, and then it's gonna be that time to go and pick up Yvonne from work. I tell you, it's now, that was very, very quick, because guess what? We have Yvonne here. Hello. Hello there. How's your day been? Absolutely fantastic. Busy towards the end. Well, guys, that was pretty much straight to the point there, wasn't it? Well, but anyway, anyway, anyway unfortunately, this is where we're both going to have to leave you. So we both want to say a huge thank you for coming by. It means the world to us. But always, always guys, 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 you've got to remember, got to, remember to do your best, to stay positive, and screw those negatives. Oh, yeah, baby. And we'll see you on the next one. All right. Bye, bye, bye. bye. bye.